What is up everybody? Happy mid-November. A lot of the major complaints around the Pixel 6 was in regards to the fingerprint sensor and the actual brightness of the display. Well, unfortunately, the brightness of a display is kind of calibrated, obviously, from the factory. There's only so many nits it can go to. Not so much you can improve on that. But luckily, there is something they can do about the fingerprint sensor. And for those of you that see my other videos, I personally haven't had any issues with it but a lot of commenters have, and there's a lot of posts all over that say just how bad the fingerprint sensor was. So I am happy to say Google surprised us with a rare mid-November update here that does fix just that. So the update size is right around 15 megabytes, and it takes a lot longer to install than what you would assume for such a small update file. But one of the main areas of improvement is that fingerprint sensor. I'm gonna let this finish and I'll show you exactly the difference it made. All right, the phone just finished updating. Let's see. Okay, that was a huge improvement even just from the length of time to put your finger down. It's unlocked now, let's lock it again. That is a big, big improvement. For a lot of people that were having substantial issues, this should go a long way for fixing that. You can definitely see how quick it actually is unlocking now. That is amazing, much, much improved. And you guys can see as well, let's go back to the about. So this is the new build number to look for. It's that dot zero three seven build um, that came out I believe it was for Verizon that they now changed for everybody. Don't quote me on that. There's been a lot of issues with this first build for the new Pixel 6 phone, but that's the one to look for. You should be able to pull it as an OTA right now. Go grab it. I just wanted to show you how substantial of an improvement they have made with this phone already. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.